Hello my lovelies, Tiger Lily here, and we are back with more of the Testament of Sherlock Holmes. Now in the last episode, Sherlock helped the rat killer to escape from prison, which is not cool. And now we are trying to talk to the bishop's, the dead bishop's nephew or something, but he's not home. So we're going to try to walk around the... the garden. Mm. Closed. Okay. So we can go through here. Without a doubt, it is the linen belonging to Henry's landlady. Indeed, there appears to be some linen missing. Hmm. There should be a spade here. Oh. What is that? A small pickaxe. Lots of lovely things. Getting here. Excuse me, don't walk on the do you think, Holmes? Stop it! A rake. Why take it, Holmes? You never know when you're going to need a good rake. Tins of food tied to one another. Hmm. The wire seems long enough. They look to me as though they're rudimentary traps used to indicate the presence of intruders. Oh, what a jumble. Anything else? Doesn't look that way. Sherlock, can you stop walking like a crazy person, please? Um, where is this shovel? There's cool. something interesting here. I need something. Uh, a spade? Good, I can pause. Ah. Nothing of interest here. The remains of a small meal. Someone has stayed here rather a long time. Hmm. This newspaper? newspaper is four days old. The bishop's nephew was being watched long before his uncle's murder. Oh. Let's see. We estimate that nearly half the population of London is threatened by a serious food crisis. At present, the most derived deprived areas are in a critical situation the sort shortages that rage throughout these areas of the capital risk turning into famine if the public authorities do not react not good nothing So, what are we missing? Are we missing anything? I just don't know. Oh, what was that? What was that? 
Watson! There's a coat up there. Or a shirt or something. This clothing is torn. The man who stole it must have caught it on a tree when he stood upon the fence. And at the moment when he jumped, he left this jacket in the tree. Nice. That's what we needed. Alrighty then. So, what do we do with the jacket? Do we hang it back up, or do we take it to the lady? I feel like we take it to the lady, because the other thing just showed up green. So... Hang on, I feel like we have to be holding the jacket first. There Is we go. Is this the washing you were looking for? Oh yes, that's it. Where did you find it? On the ground. Doubtless blown there by the wind. They didn't steal oh, it. excuse me. I'd have felt better knowing that those lurkers were nothing more than clothes thieves. That is not the case, madam. This affair seems to be rather more serious than that. It appears that these intruders were spying on Henry. Now please, let us see his room. Gracious me, whatever next. Come in. Take the first door on the left. It's open. He never locks it. Never? No, never. Well, you know him. He doesn't do things like everyone else. He lives in a world of his own. When did you see him last? Did he say anything to you? Yesterday morning. He just muttered a few words. I can't always understand what he's saying. When he does talk, that is. I can ask him a question, but he just stares off somewhere. The floor, the ceiling. As if I wasn't there. At first I found it strange, but I've gotten used to it. Hmm. Yes, I know exactly what you mean. He's sometimes nervous too, isn't he? Oh yes, as soon as anything upsets him. Even when he's alone in his room, he gets cross. And then the next second, he's standing stock still. He stares off into space and calms down again as fast as he became angry. Sounds like he's bipolar. Almost. Wait. Sherlock. Can you not? Someone emptied a bag here. Hmm. He got his scarf out, but he forgot to take it. That doesn't sound normal. There's something interesting here. Ooh. There's something interesting here. Okay, so we gotta pry that open, maybe with the spade? I am missing some information. Hmm. So we need to find a code. A violin. It is a lovely one. Where's its case? It is an impressive library someone living alone and well, he's read he all doesn't that. talk to anybody impressive that's about as many bookshelves as I have and what's so wrong with that no hat no coat this candle is still hot it's been used recently during the day whatever for This rubbish bin was emptied, and then someone threw a torn piece of paper in it. And judging by the smell, there was also an onion. Onion? Let us put these torn pieces of paper on the table. Okay. What is this strange installation? Hmm. Okay. Oh, we've got a puzzle to do. I love puzzles. I'm rather good at them. For the most part. Okay, so you always start with your corner pieces. Ooh, I see. Here we go. Oh, I can see how this could be a bit tricky uh, 
Oh, I get it now. Okay. All right, you're gonna have to give me a minute and then I'll figure it out. Cool? Cool. And last piece. Both sides of the paper are black. All this for nothing, Holmes. No. That's not Watson. This candle is still hot. It's been used recently. During the day? What mm. about before? Let me see. Let me see a thing. I need something. What is this strange installation? Hmm. Am I missing some matches or something? <sighs> it must be something I already have. It has to be. It's not going to be the scarf. This is all from the old area. Well, I mean... Why not? Oh. This candle is still hot. It's been used recently. During the day... How are you supposed what to... Before? What are you supposed to do now? What is this strange installation? Paper. Okay. This candle is still hot. It's been used recently. During the day? Whatever for? What is this strange installation? Maybe just nothing. I don't know. Okay, so I'm thinking this paper's got to do something. This candle is still hot. It's been used recently. During the day, whatever for. I am stupid. I have matches. <laughs> I guess. A box. Let's see. Oh. Oh. What is that? What? One is a one, two, three, f or five. What? I am missing some information. He scratched the lock's cipher codes for himself. Watson, write them down for us. It is noted. Mm, it is noted. Okay, where was where was the other one? I 
have noted down everything. This lock is very complex. The young Henry is remarkably intelligent. Mm. Let's try it. I'm just gonna have to try all the combinations. Empty. What? According to the label, this box <sighs> contained a Colt Patterson. It is a powerful weapon, home. It literally just started Judging mixing numbers. Receipt, it was new. Hmm. Well, now what? What do you think, Holmes? What should we do next, Holmes? I don't know. That's why I'm asking you questions. Oh. Oh. The address of a dock on the Thames. That's what I had to do? Okay. I see how you're going to play this. In the garden and in this room, pieces are missing that should never have left their places. What do you think? Um, the revolver. The violin case. Uh, That's not right. <laughs> Start again. Never should have left their place. The shovel. The revolver and the violin case. Oh. Quick, Watson, there's not a moment to lose. Go and thank that charming lady while I try to recapture our new friend. Recapture? What makes you think that he has run away? I believe that our man suffers from behavioral problems. You must have seen or heard about those poor fellows who spend their time counting the gravel stones in the garden or moving objects from one place to another hundreds of times in one day. Well, the bishop's nephew suffers from a moderate form of this condition. Nothing would be more disturbing to him than to leave a personal space in such chaos. And yet this is what he has done with this room. For it to reach such a state of neglect can only indicate that he was in a most desperate situation. That's no good. Do you think that you can catch him? Yes. The candle here is still warm, so he left only a few minutes before our arrival. But it is the missing violin case and the large pistol which concern me. We Why did you take the violin case? And volatile. It is never wise to leave a gun quite capable of killing a bull in the hands of someone like that. Did he leave to go to the address which was written in the invisible ink, do you think? Undoubtedly, Watson. And as for the mm. missing spade, I can tell you that it will be used for digging. Are you ever going to stop delaying me with endless questions? <laughs> he is Watson, so, after all. gentlemen, have you found anything? We have learned enough to promise you that they will not return. That makes me feel better. Thank you, gentlemen. We are going to pay a visit to that mysterious address, Watson. But first, we must detour to Lambeth. Lambeth? What are we oh, going to what? do there? Pick up an old friend. He will be a precious help in our locating Mr. Hampford. Good. And who is this friend? A friend who helped us in the case you so romantically titled The Sign of the Four. Who? Who is it? Who is it? I don't like that over the water shot. Is it a puppy? Here we are at the address a that puppy. the took such care to hide. I wonder what it is that links this place with the bishop's murder. The reason for the quarrel between the young man and his uncle is somewhere here in this industrial area. And that is what he has come to look for this evening. It's an enormous area, and there are dozens of potential hiding places. How on earth are we going to find it? The old dog Toby is the best sleuth hound in town. Puppy! If the extraordinary Mr. Hamford is here, look at the little pupper. Without any doubt, it's a cat. I've rarely seen such an old dog. Do you really trust his sense of smell, Holmes? Absolutely. Besides, you are going to follow him. Take the bark and go around that disused factory. If the nephew wishes to run away, he can do so only through there. If you find him, hold on to him. 
until I rejoin you. Very well. Get ready, boss. Woof, woof. Let the battle commence. Puppy. Toby's sense of smell is legendary, but he needs to know what he is looking for. Search, Toby. Search. There's a good dog. I control the puppy. Okay. We're going to leave this episode here, and in the next episode, we're going to control the puppy. Cool? So, if you guys liked the video, hit the like button down below, and subscribe to my channel if you guys want to see more of The Testament of Sherlock Holmes. It's getting really interesting. I like it. So, and if you guys want to get notified when the episodes go live, hit that bell button down next to the subscribe button, and it'll pop up in your notifications. So, that being said, this is Tiger Lily. Until next time, my lovelies. Bye!